Hey there, Geeks. Tim Tibbetts here with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to remove or update if you need older versions of Java or multiple versions. Nowadays, you shouldn't have Java on your machine unless you know you need it. If you're not sure, take a look and get it off your machine. It's a massive security risk. There's a simple way to do it, and that would be to use your control panel or settings, depending on your operating system. So, for example, Windows 7, you'd go to Start Control Panel uninstall a program find the job you want to remove and just double click it to get it out of there and then you click yes pretty easy right Windows 10 start settings find apps find your Java versions and if you have multiples get rid of all of them and just click on uninstall now there's always more than one way to do everything. There is the Java uninstall tool which you can grab from Major Geeks. That is the official one from Oracle who makes Java and it's a portable app. You just double click it, agree to the terms and what's going to happen is you're going to see various listings. See, I only have it installed once, but if you have three, four versions of it, you can check each one and click Next, and it will uninstall it. So easy enough to do. Now, if you hit Cancel, get out of there. It'll give you the summary. And if you don't have Java installed, it will actually offer for you to download Java. So let's see where were we and last but not least one of my favorite ways it's not for everybody some people don't want to be bothered is to use a third-party uninstaller I usually have iobit uninstaller on my machine but geek wise and hybit are all excellent if you're not sure go ahead and watch these videos I'll put the link in the video description you can watch and see how easy they are to use the advantage to these programs is that they will not only uninstall the program but they will find any leftover files, folders, and registry entries which are always left behind on the Windows installation. So if you have the time and you want to do it right, use that. If you want to use the official uninstall tool to look at everything, as you saw, it's pretty easy to use. And if you're in a hurry, just go ahead and go to your Start Settings apps or Start Control Panel. Piece of cake, but get that Java off your machine. As always, we appreciate the, the likes, the subscribes, and we appreciate your time. See ya.